Okay, kids. So I solved the problem. Yeah, I couldn't get the 200 to get within a centimeter. And that was, you know, a centimeter out of 20 centimeters is like 5% error right there. So I didn't want to do that. I know most of the time I say close enough for government work, but you know what? Okay. We can get better than that. I did. I just switched out the 200 and put a 50 on there. Little cute mouse. That's a little cute one. And so that's 50 uh, kilograms. 50 kilograms. Holy crap. 50 gram mass. Uh, this is a length of around 20. Let's get that in the middle. Uh, yeah, maybe 20.9 centimeters. But it's uh, 0 0.4 or 0 0.5, which is within half a centimeter, which is, you know, as I always say, again, close enough for government work, that'll work, that'll, it'll, it'll be close enough. Okay, so we ready? Uh, 20, 20 revolutions, same thing. Remember, one, two, let go, three, you start timing. Okay, here we go. So, different mass, same length, let's see what we get for a time. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, boom, done. All right, did you get it? Did you get it? Did you get it? Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Okay, so that was a 20 gram mass. And of course, we're changing it out. So that was trial four. Trials one through three is the 100. Trial four, I used the different one. We were gonna use the 200, but I couldn't get it to work. So we went with the 50 on trial four. And now for trial five, we're going to use another different mass. This is a different one we used before. I'm going, I'm going big. Go big or go home this time. Last time it was a little tiny cute one. Now we're going big or going home. We're going with 500 grams. Okay, so that is going to be certainly longer than 20.5. So let me wrap it around once to see how that looks. And that's half. Oh, this is almost perfect. This is almost perfect. Yeah, it's 20 and a half. Boom, boom, nailed it, boom. All right, here we go. So again, one, one, or two, or three, we'll let go, time it. We've got the 500 gram mass. Um, do the time on this and see what you come up with. Uh, one, two, three, oh, oh, two. Oh, I screwed that up, okay, sorry. <laughs> one, two, and three, I like, oh, I didn't do that. And you was like, what, what? Okay, that's why I'm a terrible left partner. One, two, three, one, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, seventeen. Oh crap! <laughs> oh dang it! I'm awful. I'm terrible. I screwed myself up. I. Okay, sorry. Doing it again. Having some fun, aren't we? All right. Here we go. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Five, six, focus, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seven, focus, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and twenty. And yes, we are done. Whoo! Oh man, that was brutal, huh? Man, again, you don't want me as a lap burner. Terrible. Okay, so we've got trials one through five all done. And now we're ready to do trial six. Trial six is special, okay, special, like some of you. Some of you are very special. Okay, so for trial number six, determine the length of the bob that will give a one second period of time. Now, what I need to do, what that means is, I need to come up with a length of this that'll give me a back and forth of one second. Now, the one we were just doing it, I mean, I don't know what the times were you do, right? You have them written down. Um, one, two, that was probably pretty close. Was it not? It was probably pretty close um, to, oh, yep, yep, hang on, hang on. We're going to get this right. I, I, I'm going to have to get involved now if we're going to do this right. So, oh, jeez, I can't even unbutton my shirt. I'm a mess today. I am telling you. I'm a, okay, so shirt unbuttoned. Roll it down so we get the timer going. Oh, I don't know how I'm going to do this. I'm going to try to time, watch, and do everything at the same time. Woo! This is going to be fun. All right, where's my stopwatch? There it is. There's my stopwatch. Okay, I got my stopwatch ready. So what I'm going to do is I'll take the 100. I like the 100. It's a nice little mask. With the, um, with the 500, it's actually kind of oscillating a little bit. That actually could have caused some error due to those oscillations. Um, I've got this length here right in the middle of around 22 centimeters. 22 centimeters. I'm just going to 
try this. Let it go, and I'm gonna do 20 repetitions. Uh, 20 reps to pump the eye on 20 times, 20 reps, ah, oh, boy, yeah. And so, no, 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 20 back and forth, and time it, and see how close we get to 20 seconds. Because remember, we want one back and forth per second, but I gotta do it 20 times to be accurate, There's more accuracy there. If I just do it once, I can, I can screw it all up. So here we go. All right, I'm gonna see if I can do this without well, just gonna be, uh, uh, I can't take it off my wrist because it's not gonna like that, it'll like lock me out. So, uh, I'm scared. Okay, so what I'm gonna do, hold this back here and start, no, no, stop, stop, stop. Reset, okay, ready, set, go. One, two, I did it. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Okay, I got 19.14. I hope you were doing that at home because let's see if we're gonna actually accurate times there. I got 19.14. Okay, I hope you kids did that at home. If you didn't go rewind it and do it. Do it, do it now. Okay, rewind that and get a time for that. I got 19.14. Now 20 right to 19.1, that's pretty close, all right? That's pretty good. That's pretty close. So this length is pretty much the length that we need to get us one second. Uh, let's see, that was it. So it took a little bit longer. So it means that I have to shorten it up a little bit. But if I shorten it up one more time here, that's going to make that really short and quicken it up. Actually, no, no, I said the opposite. I have to make it longer because it was short. It was quicker. It was 19 seconds and 20 reps. It was less than one back and forth per second. So I actually have to lengthen it. Now, if I lengthen this, Let's see there. Okay, that's 23. 23. Okay, we'll try that. We'll try that. We'll see how that goes. Um, okay, so reset. Uh, again, I, I did it once. I don't know if I can do this again and be accurate. You kiss at home. Time as well. See what you get. Come on. Come on. Watchy watch. Watchy watch. Here we go. Here we go. One, two, three. One, two, three. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, you know, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifty, sixty, seventy, eight, ninety, twenty. Oh, wait, 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 I hit it too hard. Don't get out of there. I don't want you. Stop. Wait, wait. Okay. I get 19.74. No, so 19.74. The first time I got 19, a little lower, and then 19.7. 19.74, I'm calling that good. I'm calling that good. Okay? Call that a day. I mean, that 19.74 divided by 20, do the math on that, it's like 0.98 or something like that. It's crazy talk. 0.97, I think is what it would come out to be. Close enough for government work and us. So that is the length that's required to give us a time period of about one second. And that is 23 centimeters, 0.23 meters, 23 centimeters. So we're going to need that. Now, mathematically, we can calculate that. We can actually calculate that using the pendulum equation, figure out how long should the, the length be in the pendulum equation to get a time period of one second. But t is one second in itself for, for L, all right? And hopefully, it'll come out to be somewhere around 23 centimeters. And that's what we got. OK, so that wraps up the gathering the numbers portion. And uh, we'll meet you back up front. OK, all right, lab partner.